The women in Haiti are the most hardworking people that I've ever known. Moms in Haiti are just like moms in the U.S. They want what's best for their kid. They want to be able to provide them with opportunities that they never had. They love their kids like we love our kids. Um, it's just that they don't have any of the resources to give their kids what they need. The day that a mom gives birth in Haiti is the most dangerous day of their life. Children and dads will say goodbye to their mom before they go deliver their baby because they don't know if she's coming home. Um, there's just such a high risk of mortality in both the mom and the baby uh, that it's sort of a something that they don't even talk about until after a healthy baby is born. Yeah, we want to take away the fear of becoming a mom um, and, and replace it with the joy of motherhood that God designed for us as women. And um, all those Haitian moms are missing out on uh, the gift of motherhood, uh, the way God designed it, because their, their reality just brings so much fear. The rush of the unknown. Every 20 minutes in Haiti, a woman dies during childbirth. And I just can't help but think about how tragic that is in the world we live in when, when healthcare is so advanced and that should just not be. And every time that happens, these families lose the, the anchor and the advocate in their family. These moms are the glue in Haiti that holds the families together. And when she's gone, they lose the person that's gonna make sure that they get a meal, that they get enrolled in school, that they, you know, grow up to, to have dreams. And so it's just so important that we provide the care and help these moms um, be able to stay a part of their families and raise these kids and be their advocates. So I just really want to invite you all to um, join this program to be an advocate for the advocates, <laughs> that we have a chance that we can um, love these mamas and give them a chance to love their families and be there for them and provide, the, provide them with the care that they need to have healthy pregnancies and healthy deliveries and know how much they're loved and cared for. You alone my confidence Ready for it all This is who we are And this is where it starts Those moms, uh, really changed the fabric of the family and when the fabric of the family is changed the community begins to change.